To another big story we are following tonight, and that certainly a lot of people have been talking about. Three restaurants in a Baltimore City neighborhood now closed for cleaning after employees there tested positive for COVID-19. Now this comes as Maryland saw fewer cases of the virus last month than we saw in April and May. Governor Hogan calling it a positive sign, however, saying it is not the time to relax. WJZ is live right now. Andy Rose Ramos explains why Governor Hogan is now targeting his virus warning at the younger generation this ahead of the holiday weekend. Andy Rose. Well, this is one of the three restaurants that shut down because their employees tested positive for COVID-19. This coming as the governor says more and more young people are contracting the virus at an alarmingly high rate. Three Canton restaurants closing after employees test positive for COVID-19. It's very unfortunate, but it's not a surprise. Announcing on Facebook they're shutting down so all their employees can get tested and the restaurants deep cleaned. People are so eager to get back out there. Neighbors say they regularly see overcrowding at bars and restaurants and not many masks. You put alcohol in the mix, you forget about the masks. The coronavirus is beginning to spread rapidly among young people. As Maryland's curve continues to plateau, it comes alongside a stern warning from the governor to the youth. Younger people seem to be acting and feeling as if they're bulletproof, and many of them unfortunately are ignoring the public health guidelines. Delaware's governor shutting down its beach bars after more than 100 new positive cases were linked to teens visiting for senior week. A lot of folks in this age group who are positive don't have symptoms. And starting today in Queen Anne's County, three of their beaches closed to anyone who isn't from there. We're recommending that people wear masks in public areas. It's not required. Ocean City's mayor urging everyone to adhere to CDC guidelines while their beaches boardwalks and bars remain open. Ocean City is not a COVID free zone. It's not. And many customers here in Canton that we spoke to today say they hope restaurants like this one will reopen in time for the fourth. Reporting live, I'm Annie Rose Ramos for WJZ.